Yeah, and we just got an update from the public information officer literally just about 30 seconds ago. So I'm just going to back up so I can look at my notes here. This is West Lafayette and North Bentlow. That is the entrance to the bridge there you see behind me with the pl flashing lights and the detectives walking around. What I understand is that around 830 tonight, an officer responded to a shot spotter alert. At that point, at some point, they tried to pull over a vehicle. An officer or officers tried to pull over a vehicle um, on Edmondson Avenue, tried to pull over that vehicle and came to a stop. Someone got out and fired shots. At that point, the car took off, came to West Lafayette here to the bridge toward the exit of the bridge so on the other side of what you're looking at there, got out of the car again and fired shots at officers. Officers then apparently returned fire. Our understanding from what the public information officer is saying is that no one was hit. Um, at this point, the officer was taken to shock trauma as a precautionary measure. They said as a precautionary measure. And um, so that is all the details that we know at this point. Again, um, we just got this information just about 30 seconds ago. But as you can see, um, there's still the detectives there. There is still the police presence. But at this point, at least we can tell you that the officer that was transported the shock trauma was taken, as they say, as a precautionary measure. For now, reporting live in West Baltimore, Kyrie, WBAL, TV 11 News.